I believe the purpose of DLAF is to increase the focus and preparedness of incoming infantry officers to the 2nd Marine Division. Starting off with zero week, the main idea, I believe, is to gauge a baseline of our normal standards and records, physical fitness being one of those. The second week, or the week up here in Fort Pickett, we work on more infantry-focused skills on being officer and infantry, uh, 1,000 and 2,000 level skills, uh, or individual and, and then uh, collective tasks. Our ability to fight as a team, to fight as individuals, to land navigate across arduous terrain during day and night, to understand how to use individual and crew serve weapon systems, how to plan for a defense, how to plan for an offense, all at night, wall tired and, and reasonably hungry and kind of uh, roughed up a bit. I think that's what, what makes this a, a very, very good event because it takes us from the basics of being a Marine and then the specifics of being an infantry officer and more specifically what is required of a company commander. I've already got friendly forces in a, in a position. The staff NCOs bring a subject matter expertise as well as an experience that cannot be replicated in any environment and having them here to talk to us about what it means to be a company commander from basic marine things all the way through tactical events has been an invaluable tool. On the same token, having majors and other field grade officers speak their mind and talk about their command experiences, how they did things tactically in, in the long wars that we've had, and then some of the, uh, the flare-ups in other areas that we've had has given kind of more of an officership insight to what will be expected of us as officers. So our final day today, this morning, started at uh, 0430, and then we lined up, we, we started in the dark, we're hiking 70 pound pack, we knew it was 20K movement, final day after a long couple of weeks. I think everyone knew you didn't want to be last because this is a competitive event and it definitely pays to be a winner. It was really perfect timing because I think at about the halfway point, the sun started coming up and I, I was thinking about it was one of those like, you know, I may actually have what it takes to lead about 200 Marines, potentially in a combat for the 2nd Marine Division. Push it through, push it.